everyone. In today's video, we'll check out the best Minolta lenses in the market. The Minolta lenses I listed here are recommended by the reviewers and have lots of positive feedback from the actual users, so if you're looking for the best one for you that is worth your money then keep watching this video I guarantee you'll find the best and suitable one for you from this list. One more thing please don't forget to subscribe to our channel, check the links in the description. Okay, let's start with the video. At the first position of our list, we have Sigma 7300 mf 4 5.6 DG lens. This lens is compatible with APS-C bodies as well as full-frame DS. It has a useful zoom range of 112-408M on Canon APS-C cameras, and 105-405M in all the others. It features 16 elements in 11 groups, one of which being a special low dispersion SLD element. It weighs 610 grams and measures 77 by 117. The body has a top-notch build and sturdy construction, while the zoom ring and manual focus ring function smoothly and efficiently. Chromatic aberration levels are quite low but they are barely noticeable while the sharpness at 300 and an aperture of f 5.6 are very impressive. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Minolta Rocker X50 lens. To start with, this lens has an incredible build quality. It is all metallic and this coupled with the knurled focus ring gives it a solid feel. Then. The vignetting is barely noticeable while the distortion is negligible too and can easily be corrected in the Lightroom. It has pretty average chromatic aberration and effective flare resistance. The bulk is also relatively smooth and will blow you away. The number 3 position is held by Minolta Maxim F1 or 200F 4.5 Tele lens. If you're looking for a lens which is affordable and yet of a very high standard, Minolta Maxim F100-200 is just what you are looking for. First, it has a simple yet sturdy construction which makes it feel good in the hands. Further, it has Minolta scales which give it a stunning and high quality look. Then, it has fantastic contrast and sharpness, and this results in visible and bright images. You will particularly be impressed with its performance outdoors in bright light. It also has an impressive background blur that will let you focus on the intended image squarely. Next at number 4 we have Minolta MD 5th M1, 1.7 mount lens. This model is the last of its kind to be produced by Minolta and was produced in large quantities, implying that it is easy to come by and is not expensive. It weighs roughly 165 grams and so is very lightweight plus it feels good in the hands. The body is scratch and dust proof while the focus is smooth, uniform, and fast. It is made out of six elements and five groups, and it has reasonable contrast. The aperture ring is made of plastic while the remainder of the body is all metal, at f 2.8. The sharpness and contrast increase while the haze completely vanishes. Vignetting also disappears at f 2.8 while the barrel distortion is very low at 0.3%. The number 5 position is held by Minolta Maxim F85 M1, 1.4 lens. The Minolta F has a body with an incredible build. The zoom ring is made of plastic while the rest of the body is all metal. It is longest at 28 and fully retracted at 7 m it also features a macro switch which will give a maximum magnification of 0.25x at 28. The lens has a focus distance window whereby 5 infrared focus index marks match with the focal length index mark. Lateral color fringing is moderate on APS-C cameras while the lateral distortion on the same type of camera as mild moderate at the wide end and mild moderate pincushion distortion at 85M. The number 6 position is dominated by Minolta Maxim Dynex F28 F2.8. This model is a small, compact lens with impressive build quality. It has a stunning gloss black finish and is multi-coated to give it a fantastic flare and ghost resistance. The circumference has rubber inserts around it to add to its stunning outward appearance. The lateral color fringing is barely noticeable while you can quickly correct the minor distortions via photo imaging software. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Konica F Zoom Minolta 75 300 lens. The Konica Afzoom Minolta 75 300 lens is ideal for birding and sports photography. This lens offers a smooth and accurate focus. It features a new distance encoding unit that enables better circulation of flash exposure. The number 8 position is held by Minolta F 1.75 mAF lens. Another great option is the Minolta F 1.75 mAF lens. This unit has an aperture of F 1.4 that allows you to take even sharp and clear images in low light conditions. In addition to that, it has a metal construction that makes it extremely solid and durable. Also worth noting is that it has a life-sensing touch switch that wakes up the meter with just a simple touch. 
Next at number 9 we have Konica Minolta F-2.8 F-1735 and wide angle lens. Next up is the Konica Minolta F-2.8 F-1735 and wide angle This unit features an anomalous dispersion that helps in minimizing chromatic aberration. In addition, it uses a spherical lenses that are quite effective in collecting distortion when using standard and wide zooms. What's more, this lens uses anti-shake technology that allows you to capture clear images at a lower speed. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Minolta F-8500 mirror autofocus lens. The Minolta F-8500 mirror autofocus lens features a solid metal construction that makes it super sturdy and durable. The 500 lens is a great choice for up-close photography and low-light situations. That's all for today. If you've already used any of these products, do let us know by commenting below. It will help others to a worthy buy. Thanks for watching.